We're gonna do a med ball chest pass in the tall kneeling position. Her toes are pegged, she's nice and straight, glutes are engaged, hip flexors tight, and she's going to generate power just with her shoulders, keeping her pillar nice and tight, not allowing any bend to happen, and she's gonna drive that as hard as she can into the wall, releasing the energy, and then absorbing the energy as it comes back without allowing her body to move. So let's go ahead and do a couple reps here. Full arm extension, again, gauge yourself, measure how reactive or bouncy the ball is to make sure, and if you need to skew up, you can, or if you need to, to push back, you can as well. But if you notice very limited movement going on as she transfers and absorbs that force, this is really gonna help her in that upper body power and developing that strength. And you would do about maybe eight to 12 repetitions, about two sets of these. And as you get better, she's catching and releasing. Another advantage is, or another technique is to go continuous or quicker. So Lauren, let's go ahead and knock out a couple. Pop, 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 pop. Four, five, six, eight, two more, nine, one more. Good job, well done. 